Hello, I'm Pat Jenkins. And I'm Dan. And this is the Big Fancy, Fancy Bang, Bang Challenge. Challenge. The Big Chick. Bang no, the Mick Chick Fancy. Or whatever. The we'll Mick Mick Bang. Anyway, Bang so this is the sequel to Fancy. our Mick Gang Bang video. Here we have the Mick Gang Bang properly constructed, and here we have a properly constructed Mick Fancy Bang. The Mick Gang Bang. See, there's the Chick Fil A sandwich here, <laughs> and there's. Five Guys Burgers here. As opposed to the little meat McDouble. Yeah, that's and like, McChicken. that's pussy. Food. So here's here's how we construct it. I don't it. eat pussy food. We're gonna take the Five Guys Burger and we're gonna split the two patties right down the middle. Look at that cheese. Oh no, my patties are coming apart. Okay, we're gonna split that in half. Delicious. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Licking that cheese. Mm. Licking that cheese, okay. And we're gonna put the McChicken or not the McChicken, the Chick-fil-A sandwich, right in the middle there. Mm, pat that down. Five Guys top goes on top. And oh. that is the McFancy bang right it there. It feels so warm. It is warm. Just like a nice bundle this of is a child. happiness. This is a fast food child that's probably 3,000 calories. This is the bastard child of Chick-fil-A and Five Guys right here. Okay, are you ready? Let me just take this piece of cheese off. It's kind of okay. dangling. I don't like danglers. Okay. Um, ready? <laughs> this is so much food. I know. Okay, ready? Set. One, two, three. That is like infinitely better than the McGang handbag. If you remember from our last video, you'll remember that part of the appeal to the McGang Bang is that the burgers are nice and juicy and that the McChicken is supposed to be nice and crispy. However, we found that that wasn't really true, right? Yeah, the, Mc, the McChicken is terrible. However, in this sandwich, that's completely true. Yeah. I mean, Chick-fil-A does a quality chicken sandwich, unlike the McChicken. Yeah. Five Guys Burgers are infinitely better than the McDouble. It's just like a higher quality sandwich. Yeah. It, it lives up to its name. I think so. And, well, I wasn't really satisfied with the, the amount of food that I got with the McDouble, even though that looks like a lot, it's not actually a lot. This is, looks like it's going to fill me up. Yeah. I'm completely satisfied with the sandwich. It's a little bit messy. I mean, Five Guys Burgers are messy. That's part of the appeal, I guess. I guess the difference is that you get what you pay for. Yeah. That you can get that for about two fifty, Whereas this costs $10 easily when you include a drink and your hospital fees. This is true. And other such things. And your things. lawyer fees. And yeah. Except I am a lawyer, so it's okay. Court fees. Yeah, I don't have to pay for a lawyer. I am one. This is so much food. See, now some people think that the bun of the chicken sandwich shouldn't go inside this, the burger. I'm not but sure. But since we constructed the McGang Bang, we thought, let's do it with the McFancy Bang. For are the we... sake of integrity, it is a little bit overwhelming. Are you regretting that? <laughs> I'm not sure. I mean, for our first time, I don't think it's an issue. But it, it does make the experience more daunting overall. This is true. So on a scale of 1 to 10, how good is it? Well, we were able to make chicken, the big gangbang on a scale of 1 to 5, right? Oh, was it? What did we give it, 2 stars? Yeah, something like that. Mostly because of the cost. It's just so cost effective. This one, I think this one easily gets like... In terms of like fast food creation, I think this one gets like 4 stars. Yeah, I think it's solid. It is. A lot of food. Good taste. Better taste than that. And, I mean, it's a little bit messy, which is the drawback, and it's pretty expensive. So, we give it, like, three, four stars. Yeah. Don't do this one on a date. Unless this is your date. True fact. Fast food gurus over here. Yep. So messy. I think we use all our napkins to wipe off the table, too. <laughs> that could be. This may be an unfortunate situation. Hold on, I have another napkin in here. Let me pull it out. Ew. Sorry. Dan, your hand is covered in ketchup and mustard, and you were going to stick your hand down your pants. It's getting my napkin. Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> and now you don't have to feel bad about eating this because you went golfing earlier this morning. Right. So much exercise. Golfing. I can't we're doing At least your arms won't get fat. <laughs> That's not how exercise works. 
<laughs> Nobody likes those flabby arms. I know I don't. Do you, Pat? We should look up the nutrition information. Yeah. If we've looked up the nutrition information, we'll put it in an annotation here. Moses is my lawyer. Because he's Jewish. We're not putting that on YouTube. <laughs> no. We'll, we'll cut that out. That'll go on the outtakes. I'll send you vomiting. End, so that it still goes on YouTube, but like, it's not, we, going, it's not on YouTube. going on YouTube because it's yeah. not in the video. So, like this section right here, too? <laughs> yeah.